Plaintiff Kenya Wade and her 16-year-old daughter, Benesha, say Benesha used to be good friends with the defendant's daughter until she had sex with Benesha's boyfriend. To get revenge, Benesha had sex with her boyfriend. And then the two girls got into a physical fight during which Benesha's coat was damaged, so they're suing. Defendant Angel Lathan and her 16-year-old daughter Kalia insist Kalia was not having sex with anyone, and they claim Benesha instigated the fight. Therefore, they refused to pay for the damage code. Tell me what happened. Your Honor, I must say, my daughter is not an angel. I repeat again, she is not an angel. Her name is Angel, and somebody's <laughs> name is Angel. That's nice. the defendant. Oh, your name is Angel. My you. Okay, so you're an angel. <laughs> Go ahead, but she's not. Yeah, Go my, ahead. But Nisha is not an Go angel. Uh, but she doesn't deserve to be bullied. She doesn't deserve to be harassed. Um, this all started over a little boy um, where the defendant's daughter has not been totally honest with her mother of the beginning of this matter. Again, this started with the little boy. Um, my daughter was going out with a guy, and the defendant's daughter had sex with the guy. So she told while she was going out. While she was going out with her, they were the best. They were very good friends. I was crazy about this little girl. I still am because they're children. I don't hold nothing against them. However, I still have to defend and stand up for the rights of my child. Anyhow, um, my daughter was going out with a guy. The defendant's daughter slept with the guy. So she apologized to my daughter, but my daughter she wasn't having it. So she got back at the defendant's daughter and slept with the guy that the defendant's daughter was going That's out That's a with. lot of sleeping. How old are you? Young lady, how old are you? 16. How old are you? 16. Now, when did all this happen? How long ago? All this happened while they both were 15. The defendant's daughter turned 16 shortly after uh, all the indications. So you got two 15-year-olds sleeping with guys. Basically, Your Honor. She did. She was honest enough to tell me that it happened. I was distraught because of what she did to get back. You know, it wasn't what, the right what was her punishment? To... What was her punishment? She didn't get one. Okay. She I'll tell you what, one. though, she'll get pregnant pretty soon. Go ahead. <laughs> State your name. Vanessa Hurst. Anything you want to tell me? No, sir. All right. You want to give me some background? Um, yes. Uh, like she said, her daughter is, an, is an innocent, um, but she's not telling the whole details about it. Her daughter is on uh, Facebook and Instagram. I actually have pictures, but I don't no. care to... Remember, she told me about her daughter. So why don't you tell me about your daughter? Um, she's not on Facebook or Instagram no, we, having did, sexual Did you hear what acts? we're talking yes, about, ma'am? We're um, talking about your 15-year-old daughters having sex. Do you want to address that? The knowledge of it, she said that they were just friends, that she was not having a sexual relationship with the okay, boy. So she denied having sex with yes, the boy? Yes, she did. All right, good. And you don't have any independent evidence that she did? No, I do not. Okay, good enough. State your name. Khalil Williams. All right. What do you want to tell me about your relationship with your friend? Yeah, your we was friend? friends. Mm -hmm. But until I found out on Facebook that she was messing with this boy that mm -hmm. I was talking to, mm -hmm. and we was going off his okay. house. Had you messed with any of her no. guys? No. Okay. And before that, we had got into it on the talk. While about we was, what? Because she was messing with this boy that I was talking to, and I was addressing her. Okay. Like, you were talking to him? Yeah. Like, mean dating him? Mm-hmm. All right, but you didn't have sex with him? No. All right, did your mother know about him? No. So she doesn't know anything about what happened then? <laughs> no. Gotcha. You tell me what the coat is about, ma'am. Well, Your Honor, everything that you're stating, I couldn't agree with you more on. I'm very disappointed in the action that my daughter has taken. And because we do have a very close relationship and that she can talk to me, no, I didn't approve of anything that she has done. and. I'm glad that she could be honest with me. However, again, it doesn't give no one the right for, to bully my child or so to harass my child. So tell me about the bullying. Um, after that incident and the two, after they were sleeping with each other's guys or whatnot, uh, Khalil started harassing my child at school. Uh, she was walking up on it, and I do not encourage at all whatsoever of my daughter fighting in school at all, okay. period. If it can be handled or taken care of out of school, long as she don't put her hands on my daughter, 
walk off, walk away, go to a teacher, go to the nurse counselor, do not fight in school. Well, Khalil took advantage of that. Uh, she started feeling like my daughter, you know, taking as my daughter was a punk, and she got comfortable with harassing her. Uh, to the last... Give me some the examples. The first incident, of... she threw Big Red on my daughter. She threw a soda on my child, and, as well as an adult, uh, in the school. And the coach who had... Uh, Normally, a, you know, facilitated, told the little girl, told Khalil, if she throw it, this was the consequences that was going to happen because my daughter had, was walking away. In the midst of that, Khalil threw the drink. Uh, majority of it got more on the adult than my daughter, but it did get on my daughter. A little cat fight broke out. Um, this is the jacket. That's the coat you're suing about? Yeah, she, my daughter had only had this for like a week uh, when it was ripped. My daughter was suspended for three days. Khalil was suspended for 10 because she didn't start it. And I had an issue with that because she didn't throw the first slick. She was being bullied. She was being harassed. And yeah. this is what it led to. And that's a big problem in society. Bullying by these young folks is leading to a, a lot more than just fist fights these days. And it's uh, leading to kids uh, committing suicide because their classmates uh, alienate them or a kid is trying to do their best so they're less likely to get involved in destructive behavior and several kids are so they think the one that isn't involved in destructive behavior is a punk so therefore I'm a bully this punk and so I sympathize about that if that occurred I'm sorry to hear about that and let me also applaud you uh, for um, taking responsibility for your child's actions starting out this case saying she's not an angel you've taken responsibility about everything that she has done you haven't stood here and try to deny everything she's done I applaud you for that. I applaud you for that, and I suggest to you that things are going to work out a little better for your uh, child um, if you keep that attitude. Sounds like you're practicing a little tough love. Uh, my mother was like that. It was whenever something happened in the neighborhood, not only would she not deny it was me, she would call to see if it was me. Right. Yeah. <laughs> she would somebody break in a house or steal something or whatever, she called the police. She said, hey, come check my son now. <laughs> he might have had something, to, no evidence that I had anything. Nobody <laughs> called her and said, I saw Gregory do so and so. No, she would say, somebody did what? <laughs> OK, it might have been Gregory. <laughs> uh, police officer, come check him out. Here, come get his fingerprints. Uh, so and so and so and so, I'll help you. I'll bring him down. You want to interrogate him? <laughs> That's what my mother did. <laughs> and ultimately, it worked out. Do you want to say anything about your knowledge of the fight? Yes, I talked to the... Well, I have paperwork from mm -hmm. the assistant principal... Tell me first. Um, ...about the fight, and it was um, about the boy, that they were both... My daughter was supposedly seen, or she said, talking mm -hmm. to. Got, that, got all the stuff about the boy, boy this, boy that, sex this, sex that. We're talking about the fight now. The what is actual your fight that they had, um, Benasia um, told my daughter to throw a pop on her, and she did, and mm -hmm. then they fought. Okay. Now, why would she do that? All right. That's, well, it's stated, and you it's ladies stated want to speak? The... Young lady, you want to speak? No, sir. All right. Did you want to speak about the fight? It's stated in... No, the... I said, did you want to oh, speak well, no. about the fight? No, sir. Okay, good enough. Was anyone charged with assault? Throwing a pop at someone is assault. Well, believe it or not, uh, Your Honor... Um... She's shaking her head. So, obviously not. No, I didn't because, again, I have a history with this family. Uh, me right. and Angels and Mothers grew so up together. So, law enforcement didn't get involved at now, all. I show, actually, the, the day after the fight, Khalil went home and put it on Facebook. Uh, asked, but, uh, I know, but asked, law enforcement never got involved. Later, they did because I snapshotted and took all of that to school. All the evidence that Khalil was putting okay, on so Facebook. Okay, so law enforcement did no. get involved. Well, no, not at that time. They didn't. I didn't no, ask you didn't. when. <laughs> not at that time, I didn't they ask didn't. you when. Ever. In the end, yes. Okay. But not at that That's point, That's when it no. happens. It usually no. happens after the fight. No. <laughs> Me being Did naive... Did they ever get involved? Yes, They're sir. law enforcement... Yes, okay, thank you. <laughs> Lord, have mercy. And what happened as a result? Was anyone convicted of anything, placed on probation, taken to juvenile, a court hearing? Any of that happened? Uh, we had went to court. Ooh. <laughs> 
from the mouth of babes. <sighs> so you all did go to court. What happened in court? Um, they really didn't do anything. They just gave her a uh, community service, that's all. Community service means she was convicted. You don't get community service for being innocent. Right. You don't get it for being innocent. You want to talk about the conviction, anyone? Yes, yeah, so I had 20 hours of community service, and they referred me to go to an anger management class and see if I needed it, but I didn't when I first went. Mm -hmm. and okay. They so don't they conclude know. you were guilty. You do understand that. Well, yes, I guess. No, don't guess about it. You did. <laughs> Let me inform you. Uh -huh. You did 20 hours of community service, and, on, and only way to get an order for you to do something is okay. if you're convicted, if you're guilty. It may come off your record, all of that. I hope it does. Juvenile records typically aren't used. Look at me when I'm talking to you. Don't look over there. Look directly at me. Don't look down. Don't look up. You're not in front of your teachers. You're not at school. Well, they take that. I don't take it. Mm -hmm. All right? Now. What do you want to tell me, ma'am, about the coke? When she, the charge that she got the 20 hours for and the community, the, uh, went to seven counties for to see if she need anger management is not for the fight that was in school. Um, after, uh, they had an altercation. What fight was it for? It wasn't for a fight at all. She went, my what daughter. What did she go for? What did she go to court for? You she, know, what was she convicted for? Um, her mother went down and filed charges her for. Her mother. Yes. And ultimately, she was convicted for the thing she charged her with. <sighs> yes, she was. Well, what are you talking about? $325 is your judgment. Have a good day. I'm not worried about it. You oppressed that broke I'm You oppressed You happy still oppressed that broke like today. I said before. I don't feed off into that. You don't have Where to. Where do I exit? You don't have to. Yeah, you need to exit quick, fast, and hurry.